Alright, so this time let's try to find the sine series. For the sine series, you have to use this formula. So, And by the way, for the sine series, you don't need to calculate B0. There is no B0 in the formula. See, so okay. f of x in the sine series is simply just sigma n from 1 through infinity of Bn sine n pi x over L. So there is no B0 to, to calculate separately. So in some sense, sine series is easier to calculate than cosine series. All right. L is 5 in this context. And then f of x is x plus 2. Um, sine of n pi x over 5 dx. That's what we have to do. And because I have a product of two functions, I need to use either integration by parts or tabular integration. Let's use tabular. That's my favorite. x plus 2 is the one you have to differentiate. Differentiate to 1. Differentiating 1 gives you 0. You stop here. Sine n pi x over 5. This sine n pi x over 5 can be written as sine of sine of n pi over 5 times x. This and that is the same thing, right? The reason I want to write this in this format is because this thing uh, looks like sine of ax, and I know that if you integrate sine ax, negative 1 over a comes in front, right? So it's negative 1 over n pi over 5, which means it's the reciprocal. So it's 5 over n pi cosine n pi over 5. And then, integrating this again, uh, the reciprocal of this comes up in front again, giving you 25 over n squared pi squared. In other words, this squares. Okay? And then you get sine n pi over 5 x. And then the first column is the sine column. It alternates, starting always from the plus. Then you go so like that to find the result. And by the way, if this is not 0, then you, you also have to integrate the last row. That's, uh, uh, that's a downside of the tabular, tabular integration. Sometimes if this is not 0, then it, it gets a little, little more involved. Okay. But for our case, it's perfect. Yeah. For our case, it's uh, x. Uh, the integral here, you, you get uh, uh, x plus 2 times negative 5 over n pi times cosine n pi over 5x. And if you multiply this, it's uh, <coughs> this, this, and this. So negative times negative, that's positive. So you get 25 over n squared pi squared, and then sine n pi over 5. And then adding everything that you get after multiplying it that way is the result of your integration. We still have 2 over 5 as before. Let's write down what we got over there. x plus 2 times negative 5 over n pi cosine n pi x over 5. And then, then plus 25 over n squared pi squared sine n pi x over 5. That's the integral. Now you have to plug in the endpoints 5 and 0. It's called the fundamental theorem of calculus. Did I make any mistake? Is this all good? Okay. Yeah. Just making sure. Okay, now, if I plug in 5 or 0 to this one, which will, what will I get? I'll get 0 for both cases, right? What? If I plug in 5 here, 5 over 5 is canceled, then you get sine and pi. Oh, by the way, uh, maybe it, this is worth mentioning. Sine and pi is 0. zero and cosine and pi is? Negative 1 to the nth power. Okay, so I have to make use of that. So if I plug in 5 or 0, in both cases, the sine will give me 0. So the only non-zero ones will be coming from this, this other one. 
Okay, so let's see. If I plug in 5, 5 plus 2 is 7, negative 5 over n pi. And then if I plug in 5, you get cosine n pi, right? So you get negative 1 to the n pi. That's what I get when I plug in 5. This gives you 0. Then if I plug in 0, you get cosine of 0, which is 1. So it's minus. And then this is 0 plus 2, so it's it's uh, 2 times 2 times negative 5 over n pi times 1. So that's the result of your calculation. Uh, we should simplify it. How do we simplify it? I guess 5 can cancel with both of these. And then 2 times 7, that's uh, 14. So you get negative 14 over n pi, negative 1 to the nth power. And then 2 times 2 is 4, and minus minus is plus, so it's plus 4 over n pi. And that's your, that's your bn. And what remains is to plug in that bn here and finish it. Okay, so uh, the answer now is negative 14 over n pi, negative 1 to the nth power, plus 4 over n pi. And all that is a coefficient of sine n pi x over pi. So that's the final answer.